Excuse me. Excuse me. Sir. Yeah. Sir, I need I need dire help. My friend, my friend just fell off that bridge over there and he's falling down the river. Can you come with me? Alright, well, I can do the best I can to look alongside. I can follow you around there. No, uh, it's not the best one in terms of this area over here. I don't know where they done gone, but they fell off that bridge just a minute ago, and I need help. Hmm. All right. You want to check the right side? I'll check the left. I mm -hmm. can't. I followed them down river, but I came back up on the road. All right. This seems like a robbery waiting to happen. Daisy! Mm. Daisy! You sure your friend's around here? Also, why the hell was he gone? God, oh, don't tell me he tried jumping the bridge. He tried jumping the bridge. He thought he could try and take it. Oh, Lord. I don't know why he fell down, and then I came down here to try and follow the stream, but I mm -hmm. found him. Well, I'm rather sorry for that. Hold on, I'll try to go more to the right. What now? I'll go more on the right side to see if I can find your friend. I'm being incredibly precautious right now. Again. David, where is your dumb ass? I don't like this right now. Seems a little bit too convenient. Mm. If there would be anyone hiding, where would they hide? They probably would hide to the right side, or in one of these bushes. Go look incredibly carefully now, because of course... No, no luck. I don't know where the hell that man done falling off to. How long has it been since your friend had managed to uh, get lost? Uh... Not good with time, maybe about seven minutes. Fell downstream mm. and I've tried following it, but then up and left somewhere. All right, well, can master put in a report for the, uh, the law to try to take a bit more easy of look for that. This is uh, quite just, the, uh, the river. Just lead anywhere. Uh. Look at that big ocean out there, or flat iron or so. Yep, yeah, flat on lake, correct. Welcome back, V Hunter. Don't know where the hell that man could have gone. Mm. I suppose you could take his place. Come on, mm. hop off the horse now. How you doing, sir? What's your All name? Right. The name is Swan, and you are. Well, my name is Curtis Cunningham, sir. How are you? Nice to meet you, Mr. Cunningham. Now, we'll be doing this. <laughs> Just a caution. Mm -hmm. All right. I hope you know what you're doing, Mr. Cunningham. I know exactly what I'm doing, sir. I see that pretty little badge on your little petticoat. Let's see. It's very Keep obvious. Quiet now. You know who I am. You've been informed on who I am, sir. No, I have not. Well, my name is Curtis Cunningham. And I am a good friend of your Deputy Marshal. Deputy Marshal Rico Ortega. And I've taken upon myself to make sure his little operation falls just like mine did. Due to that man. Now, if mm. you don't mind, I'm going to be taking this weaponry off of you. And then we're going to go somewhere, all right? All right. If you want to yeah. talk or, I guess, exchange of words, I have no problem with that. If you want to send that to Rico. All right. Lemon! Get your ass over here! 
Where's that damn horse? Uh, I won't make it a group therapy! Free! What do you name your horse? Uh, my horse is uh, Bella. Bella, you name it after folk? Yes, that was after uh, a loved one that I cared for had died. Well, I guess I could see the sentimentality, but I ain't one for sentimentals. I can tell. I ain't gonna steal no ring or wedding, part gift or nothing. Well, oh, I deserve it. Oh, well, your crap. loved one's ghost still seems to be chasing after you, sir, so I'm gonna leave him be. You definitely got some high spirits looking after you. Of well, course. Looks like we gonna be going on a... Ah, fuck it, I don't... I hate walks. Everything always turns out bad. <laughs> <laughs> fuck it. Well, what was your name again? Swan. Swan. Well, Swan, I don't know how close you are to Deputy Marshal Ortega, but I know that you are in business with Deputy Marshal Ortega. What do you about know business. about business? Uh, business, I mean, you're working the same damn job, ain't that right? That's correct. Now tell me what you know about it. Nothing much other than, of course, uh, it's just a Deputy Marshal. He don't tell you nothing about what he done did before? No, I don't know too much about him. It's just only my superior, that's all. all right. Can't see him. See, I've done got a hand on that little girl that he likes. That Fletcher. So you Brave ain't gonna Fletcher. Get, you ain't gonna get the worst out of it. I am gonna leave you with a little scar, though, if that's fine by you. Seems like I have no other choice. <laughs> now, tell me which hand do you use to pull the trigger? Uh, more of a, uh, sometimes I tend to use my left, sometimes I tend to use my right. It's a bit of both, but... There you go! Uh, uh, Alright, son! Now, uh, see, I left Miss Fletcher with a bit of a parting gift where I sort of sliced the tendon above her foot, but I ain't gonna do that to you. Ow. See. You gonna count to 90. You know how to count? <laughs> yes, I know how to count. You All bastard. Right. You start <sighs> counting. And when you get to 90, you get out of them ropes. <clears throat> Alright. Now what's my <clears throat> name again? Curtis Cunningham. Say Not the Curtis. That is the same one I think it is. No, I don't know who the hell another Curtis is. Now say it again. Curtis Cunningham. Curtis what? Cunningham. Thank you, sir. That is correct. I am Curtis Cunningham. <laughs> and you let Deputy Marshal Ortega know that I ain't done yet. Uh. Come on, Lemon. By the way, I name him Lemon. Because every time you see him, you pucker up. <laughs> <laughs> Take care, detective. Um, while we're delivering bad news, the Lobos are about again. Yes, I figured. Yeah, they uh, they arrested Skip. Uh, sorry, arrested. They uh cuffed Ernst, and then they robbed him and Skip. I just finished a report about it. <clears throat> it's always something new, isn't it? Yeah. Every time, the moment we have a bit of calm, there just always seems to be a lot more of them that just come on back. Or they reveal themselves. Yeah, well, you know, we'll just keep pushing back like we always do. I hope so, because it's not going to be pretty at this time. The more I keep seeing them, the more I want them dead. Well, hey, let's not go too far. Campbell, you were there in Tumbleweed. You've seen that, the atrocities of what had happened. And I know things might get a little bit more hairy in there and other things like that. Uh, these are the type of people you don't just lock up. You put them in Sisica. Well, if not, if they don't want to be locked up in Sisica, you kill them. Because they're trying to kill you. 
That's just how things are. It's rather harder around here. And I know that there's many different things, including Ernst, according to uh, Jacob, had mentioned that he's starting his own sort of outlaw group just to stop the Del Lobos. Mm-hmm. There's a lot more that is starting to fall on our plate now. And it's because of the Del Lobos compared to any other group at the moment that's going to make this rather very interesting for all of us. Now, on top of that, we also have another deputy that is kidnapped by a psychopath. She's out there. She has hooks in her cheeks, Campbell. The man that had managed to cut into my arm had mentioned he had cut the tendon above her foot. There's a lot more things that are going on right now. It's getting very tiring for me. We're being toyed with like a piece of meat. Eventually, one way or another, we have to put our foot down. I know it's rather harder to see that, and I know we do want to put them in jail. But it's going to be more rougher for us. Because now, you have other groups of parties that are trying to get themselves involved, in which is going to get more people killed for no reason. But now it's basically what we see before us. It's life and death. Swan. Yes? Uh, three armed men with ponchos on Main Street. Oh, Jesus Christ. Campbell? Yeah. Howdy, partner. Campbell! Oh, oh boy. Two of them, they, they, they're they going back to Thieves Landing, that's what they said. Okay. Bastards. They're writing to Thieves Land. They asked me for permission, but I told them that I don't have any. Uh, all right. Is the okay, Lobos? Though? Yeah, they didn't rob me or anything. I just asked them to put away their guns and they... I really didn't understand what the man said. But whatever, they said they're writing back to Thieves Landing. And when I uh, when they wrote off, they shot. Not mm. at me, just in the air. All right. I was just trying to make sure about the, the gunshots. Two. Man and a woman? Yeah, man and a woman. Yeah, and I've already got a report about them. Oh, well, well, if they're going to Thieves Landing, let's mount up. Let's go. Uh, I might try to do the best I can with my shot, but it won't be as good because there was a man who I had seen that just cut into my left palm by the name of Curtis Cunningham, which Where? had mentioned that he has faith. He, had, uh, he doesn't have faith anymore, though, does he? No, they do. He does have her again. Yeah, and apparently anyone that's involved alongside with Rico Ortega. Not sure what it is. The report says that Faith was rescued. So what's the story? Is she gone again? I'm not sure. Is she? What do you made it sound like? There's a horse that's all the way at the right. White horse. Could be wild. I think it's a wild one. Hmm. No saddle. Were they both saddled horses that you saw? Yeah. They should be deep inside. I might go and take high ground to see if I can see anything, but this fog is going to make it worse. I see a turkey, man. It might have been mine. Oh, that was yours, probably.
mean, out of everything in you know, this situation, uh, remember how good your shot is? Huh? Do you remember how good your shot is? No. Let me move in closer. Nice jacket. Who's? The other guys. Oh. Oh, yeah, yeah Campbell. I got the same jacket. Oh, good choice. Mm -hmm. Alright, hold on. Yeah, you're chicken into because Jesus sent good of a shot. Yeah, well, right. he had his opportunity to take it, and he decided not to. His loss. Next we managed to try to do a shootout better. properly. Yep. Stop being a chicken. Him, then, I, guess. I want to avoid a shootout as much as possible. I'm still trying to convince him to turn himself in. Your general direction. Oh, come on. <laughs> this is tense. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. No, come on. Last chance, John. Come on. Come on. Come on. Sure has. Come on. I'm ready. Oh, Jesus Christ, Joe! Is it all of them? No, there's more. Oh god, move! I cannot move! Nice! Oh my god, jeez. You around? Shit, yeah. Where's Wexford? Down this way. Jeff? Jeff! Where's Wexford? He is right here. Oh shit. Oh, Wexford. We sort of talked to Delilah about it earlier. Maybe she's still about. What about the other two? Oh, Joe! Alright, if we transport him, be careful with his head. Weird. Does anyone have gauze or bandages at least? I got bandages. Alright. I've got some supplies and bandages. You have supplies as well, too. We need right. to stabilize his head. Alright, what else is incoming? Alright. Well, very good then. Okay, so I had... What?! Oh god. Oh no. I have to go! No, oh, no! I'm you really right? sorry that I could uh, I think someone has taken Rashidju. I've gotten a telegram from him saying to help me. Okay. <sighs> What the hell? Oh my god, oh. alright. God damn it. Right, I'm so sorry. Oh, you did? Alright. Get back to you. Uh, hey, what's on? You okay? Uh, no, no, no. I have oh, to go back to the telegram office. What's up? I'm not sure what's happening. I just know that, of course. Uh, <laughs> I got a telegram. I was just checking my telegrams, talking to it. Yes. Uh, uh, Mr. Nat, uh, about the therapy stuff. And as soon as I check my telegrams, I uh, get a letter. It's from a and oh, it, it sure just it, it, it writes help me on it. Now, uh, yes. can you help the doctor? Yes, I can. I'll go with. Uh, Does it say anything else? With no, it doesn't say anything else. But I'm gonna send a telegram back. What, wait, what's the standing station? What's the stamp on it? I don't know. I have to look at it again. Okay, Let me just get my coat. 
Joe, can you grab a swan? Thank you so much, Miss I'll, I'll come with you, swan. That person, Mr. Cunningham, whatever his name is, he didn't mention about something of uh, Rico's past or whatnot. Even try to question me to see what I could know about him. Now I'm trying to figure out what is it that Ortega did. Did he promise someone something or whatnot? I, I don't know. I, I, he must have done something now. I don't know anything about Ortega, honestly. That's what I'm saying. I only know him as the superior. That's all. Mm -hmm. Or our superior. Alright, it's straight ahead. If y'all can, see if you can surround it. I'm gonna go straight in. I can't even... Excuse me? You found her? Yeah. Oh, she's alright. Check around! Check around! He told me to run back to town and I made it here. It's alright. Okay. You're still here. We're gonna get you to the doctor. Alright. Just look at me. Look at me. Just look at me. Alright. We're gonna miss a goal. Get you back to town, right? I can hear you. I'll put you on the horse. All right. And then okay. we'll talk about it a bit more. But right now, we have to get you out of here. I don't know what it is. I don't know what this man wants either, all right? But we got to get out of here, right? He I'm wants to take her. I know. Grab me as well, too. I thought it was someone that needed help. And Are you, are you okay? Yeah. All he managed to do was go and slash my palm. What he did to you necessarily was something completely different. Did he, uh, did he try to ask you on? What, what did you know about Ortega? He did. And he said a lot of things. What did he say? Ortega used to be in his gang. Okay. Oh. 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 Oh my God. Um. Hmm. I feel like I should convey this properly, but uh, we just got new information from Rashidu. Um. Back. Uh. History. Of uh, Ortega. Apparently, he was a, a part of uh, Mr. Cunningham's gang at one point. 